In this video, we want to look at the problem that we can't choose segments anymore in a curve, which is not one degree anymore, but probably two or three degrees. And uh, this is a curve of uh, one degree, just a normal polyline um, curve. And with shift and uh, string, I can s select segments and I can also delete them. But uh, if I take this curve and I just um, copy this with Alt key, and I just uh, choose this and just say, say change degree. By the way, I can also fill it, it doesn't make any difference. Then I can't use shift key anymore and select uh, part of this key like, uh, like before. So uh, what we can do, uh, do about this, because this is a continuous geometry, it's not possible. Uh, what you can do is you can just add points. You just select near point and just add points on the line, uh, spacebar and another point. And uh, then you just use the command uh, split and you select the split object you want to split. And then you select your cutting objects, these two points. And um, if you press enter, then you can just see that you uh, are able to uh, split the curve, which is a little bit like uh, segmented uh, in, in the parts you would like uh, then to Okay, let's have a look at another example from my course Digitales Entwerfen 1. Uh, we have this object uh, with a pipe and uh, we would like to uh, optimize some parts. You would like to uh, choose segments, but uh, if I use uh, shift and uh, string, you can't see any, select any segments because it's a continuous geometry. Um, two options you can do, you can just change the degree again, just say change degree and from two, actually right now you go to one and now you have lines again and now you can select these lines and uh, you can probably just say uh, extract, uh, extract um, subcurve, select uh, pulley which uh, uh, subcurve to extract for example this one and then you just press um, enter again. And uh, here we go, we just uh, subtracted one curve and this is one way of doing it. And then of course you can just say again, uh, change degree, but I could imagine there's a problem. Uh, you will see it right now because here, uh, this doesn't look good anymore because at this point uh, it's not round. So um, one option to get to the segments, but that's not what you want. We do it like before, we just take, um, a single point, I only select it near and I set it on the line uh, and uh, like this. We choose the line and we just say split and now we choose the cutting object somewhere like this. I press enter and now we can see that you were able to uh, split these uh, parts of the curve and um, have it separately and now you can just say you pipe uh, this part with a radius of one, somewhere like this, and you can also pipe this one with a radius of one, and uh, they still fit. And uh, if there was probably before a twist in your geometry, you will not have it anymore. Thanks for watching.